what's up guys welcome back to another another video and today guys we're gonna work in our <coughs> building and hunger hunger bar it's yeah it's very easy guys guys very very easy and if you want to know more about how to use variables in GDevelop, you can check out this vi video that I made how to um how to use variables and global variables in GDevelop. Be right up here. Link will be right up here to go. So yeah, I mean description. So yeah, guys, please support the channel by subscribing. And yeah. Hungry bar. So here we got a hungry bar. So when the <coughs> player is gonna get hungry, he has to eat something. Oh, so let's play right here. You can see the hunger bar. I'll just create a player. Um. Let's create this guy here. Ready guy and you know um a um a black round eye. Oh like he looks in that direction. And let's copy that and he has a huge amount. Okay. Let's call this not mouth and mouth. What? Uh, I name is two player. Okay, and I say this is what the a here smaller size like twenty five twenty by twenty five and. Uh, this is um that's not a guy. Well, he's not as awful. Let's call this food. food. And let's create uh Uh, <clears throat> platform say a white platform and let's name it um round and just say it's a platform and this is um Platform character with no default control, no default control, and this is a platform character. Class your players, you're gonna give a default control. So, as you see, wait, let's see the custom size 20 by 20. You guys, so the guys want to eat them. And bring back up the bar. Uh, <clears throat> let's see what's the length of this. Yeah. Um. Let's call this hunger. Hunger system. 
founder system. So uh first gonna create actual give that the hunger ball ball bar it's variable. So we're gonna go here into players edit variables and call this hunger three hunger and give it a uh, hundred. So here you're gonna say um put the size so you're gonna say scale it on the x of or it should be scale say equal to the 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 variable object variable object the player hunger and as you said, I'll show you in other videos how to fix this. I will also show you in this video. It's quite simple. All you're gonna go is press um this and say 40. And there you go, guys. Alright, so you're gonna say um let's go here and say time. I said you want to time it. Um, let's see. Uh, just put this and say 0 0.5. You don't have to put no names. See, it's every, every 0 0.5 seconds. No, every. Wait, um, let's get checking time for time scale. Since every zero, every 40 seconds, every 40 seconds, um, the variable of player hunger should be subtracted by 0 0.1. Now let's see here. Yeah. Um, every ten seconds, um, I say every <coughs> One second, then let's see the story. Okay, it's, it's working. So let's say every 15 seconds, then sorry, it 0 0.1. Okay, so just, just use one. And just say it negatives zero point one. So let's check. So let's see what's going on. So you can see his life is slowly going down. And if he don't eat, if he don't eat, he's gonna <coughs> all die. So you can see so also we're gonna do something so when <clears throat> when the distance between player and food is 12 pixel change change the animation of player to say Change change the image up by name. Um, 
put it to um mouth one uh so let's see how this happens. It wasn't mouth one that I did it, um, mouth, mouth one, what am I, below, it's below, um, it's below 12 pixels, set animation, when, So there you see like his mouth open now and stuff. <clears throat> let I put twelve pixels, let's say thirty. Since so I just copy this and paste and just invert it. When you invert it instead of it's below is greater than so when it's greater than thirty pixel set it to just Mouth. So let's see. Thirty pieces of reading. I don't know. Um, sixty. Sixty. Let's see now. So you can see like his mouth open up to eat this guy. Um a maybe she just play a hundred and finish it all. Um a so let's play. Yeah. I know he's gonna eat him. Uh, now let's say when player when player collides with food but when 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 player collide with um food um delete delete um food um and To player very well hungry um add twenty so, yeah I see let's get more food out here twenty five Twenty-five. So you can see, like up here, he's going down, and you go it up. He can go down. See, yeah, guys, that's it. And if you guys want to build a hungry game, I guess this is the the kind of eating game. I guess this is the kind of way to build it. And you can just say when when the health bar, when the hunger bar. Bar is reach to let um to you say equal or uh, less than zero, he can do it. Yeah, um, he is gonna deal with the player. So let's just do that. I'll show you guys how to do that. Um, just say um when the variable of player hunger is less or equal to zero, delete um. Delete player. So, let's see, and it's just that simple. And you can even make him like run away from the player if you want. Like the guys run away from the when they see the player. So yeah. So let's wait out. See what happens. See what happens when our life goes all the way down. Bam. Say so your players guys, so please subscribe, like, and share this video. Thank you guys.